Hi, my name is Joyce, and this is my Zombie Colonel America. I'm so glad that Marvel decided to do a zombie toy. I'm not a big fan of Colonel America, but to me, this figure is really good. I like that um, they make him look really zombie-like, and they make him look really gross and disgusting and creepy looking. Uh, I like the way they did his body. Uh, I like the way they did his stomach. I'm obsessing over his stomach and because uh, he looks so starving. And, um, you know, zombies, they do what they do best. They devour on fresh flesh. <laughs> I like that they add that feature with them. It's my favorite uh, feature on his body is his stomach. And I really love his, his face. Um, arms, wrists, knees... Um, ankle, head moves full 360, the legs move in and out, um, the waist rotates, um, and it moves 360, um, it's a really good, durable toy, it's not easy to break, but again, beware of, uh, new toys, they intend to break when they're fresh out the box because the joints are so stiff still. So what you can do is you can play with them a little bit to loosen up the joints in them. Uh, a few of my figures I had to do that with. Um, just beware of not breaking the toy because, again, when they're fresh out of the box, they intend to be really stiff and they don't want to move certain places when you try to pose them. So before trying to pose them, beware of their joints being stiff. But um, the toy is really nicely detailed all around from the boots right up to the head. Um, his top crown comes off. You can see inside his brains. and um, I like the color schemes. I don't like the star, but hey, it's Colonel America. I mean, he represents the flag, I guess. But um, it's, not, it's my least favorite character. My boyfriend, this is his favorite character. Um, I really wanted to review it because I'm a zombie. Um, comic book nerd, I'm a zombie movie nerd, I'm a zombie um, everything, so I really wanted to review this guy for you guys. Um, um, again, I like I like the figure in particular. It's not a bad figure. You can pose him any way you want. Um, in particular, like, I like his stand. His stand is really different. The only thing I don't like about it is that I really wish the stand had like a pin in the bottom. You know how toys have pins in the bottom. You could easily put them on the stand better without them shifting on you. It sucks because if I do want to pose them on top of the stand, he uh, he shifts and he moves and he falls. So it's a bit of a hassle. But if you have patience, I don't. You can try and pose them on the stand. The stand tells a little story. The Silver Surfer, there's his arms and I'm guessing the blue. It's like his blood gushing out and... I really want to get the Hulk to um, the set. I don't want to get the Spider-Man. The Spider I'm not a big Spider-Man fan, but the Spider-Man is too flimsy for me. I, he looks like he'll break, and I'm really rough with my toys sometimes. Um, I know it's bad, but I I am. I would just rather to get the Hulk and um, Colonel America. Like I have Colonel America, so I can't wait to get the Hulk. The Hulk will be cool. I just love the Hulk. He looks really sick. Um, but the stand is really different. I like the stand. I just don't like that you can't pose him on it the way you want without, you know, without him shifting and moving. And you can't do too much dramatic poses on the stand because, um, it's not big enough. So when you try to pose and make sure it fits in the criteria of the stand. But I, a couple of things I didn't like about the toy, I, I just listed it, but... Overall, it's a good toy. I, I like him. I like that uh, he's a zombie, and I like that um, he has features that I like. Um, I'm not... I'm, I can't complain too much. I mean, it's, it's a great toy. I, I, I like it. Um, uh, yeah, so that's my um, Colonel, Zombie Colonel America toy review, and I hope you guys liked it. Thank you. Bye.